Alright everybody, welcome back. We are still in the Hufflepuff common room. We finally got to Hogwarts. We chose Hufflepuff. Fan favorite. I don't know if there's any huge difference between the houses, but Hufflepuff and Ravenclaw have always been my favorite. Okay. Am I not allowed up there yet? No, nope, I don't think I'm allowed upstairs yet. Well, let's continue on. Meet Professor Weasley outside the common room. There we go. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Okay. Here you are. What is that? Just a random Hogwarts uh, spell book? What is it? It is a wizard's <laughs> exactly. field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Okay, where do you put that? Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Okay. I love the ambient music in this game so far. Just the background music. It's very pleasant. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding lore. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Well, then why Using is it not the guide mandatory? Will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. Do keep up. Why is it not mandatory if you think you should have had it? Just make it a thing. Simply cast Revelio on it. And we'll see what the guide says. Revelio. What does it say? Fill guide page collect. House, house elf recipe book. Rumored to contain some of Helga Hufflepuff's original creations. This book holds a collection of Hogwarts students' favorite recipes over the centuries. God, I'm stuttering today. Some dishes like the pickled didgerable plums are likely an acquired taste. Dirigible. Field guide challenges, okay. Open field guide. Okay, so here's where we keep... Okay, nice. I was wondering when I'd have like a menu. Because so far all I've had is the save menu. Where is it in level? Oh, field guide. Challenge progress. So you can find the pages. Okay, nice. What else you got? Clever, isn't it? <laughs> Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that. Inside and outside of the castle. I was just wondering right off the bat. Gear. Because I have different gear already. Right, don't I? From the DLCs that came with the game? Can I not equip them yet? Is this not the right selection? There's a lot of stuff to go through. Okay, quest items, notes, resources, beasts. 
It's in my inventory. Oh, I can go through it up top, dummy. What does my collections have? That's Revelio pages. Just the uh, Helga, Helga Hufflepuff book. Ooh, wow, that's an actual... Ooh, I actually like that map. Hold up. Let's go back to gear. I got that stuff with the uh, DLCs. How do I... Uh, change appearance. Oh, here is it. here it is. So it's just an appearance change. So that's Azkaban prison, prisoner coat. I don't want to look look like that through here. Merlin's cloak. That is so far my favorite. Dark arts. No. Yeah, we're gonna go uh, Merlin's cloak. That looks sick. The Dark Arts Ensemble doesn't look bad, to be honest. Yeah, we'll go with the uh, full... Okay, <laughs> Silver Dragon-Eyed Spectacles. I kind of like it. I'm not even lying. But that's... Yeah, that's that's it right there. I don't have anything else. Yeah, okay. I just wanted to... I was wondering where I'd be able to access that. Because I was trying to mess around before I started filming. Yeah, I love that. That's sick. Merlin's cloak. Oh, this place is freaking actually beautiful. Revelio. Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Your Blue flames, field guide okay. contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. That's the map. Central Hall. Was oh, it okay? Am I going there? I guess I'm going there. Central Hall. Is this back into the main area where we were assorted? Yeah, I already know about target lock. That's a good hint. Anything else? And here we are. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. Okay. You can get almost anywhere in the castle. Just a random flying Central book, Hall. okay. <laughs> like a bird in the castle, just a flying oh, book. Oh, there's something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. Revelio. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both charms and defense against the dark arts classes today. Yeah, I wonder and who the I'd professors are for those. And I'd like to be sure those. you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Okay, he's looking sick. Yeah, can you tell me more, more about Charms class? What will I learn in Charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes. All terribly useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard. And a talented teacher. Okay, what about Defense Against the Dark Arts? Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who aspire to become Auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecat in charge of Professor our students' Hecate. education in that regard. You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array of shops and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. Thank you, Professor. Thank you, Professor Weasley. So which class a do I have to go to, to first? A on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. Of course You'll they be have. You'll be up to speed in no time. 
Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. I mean, he, he did, had, had a good He's adventure before he even started vague school. As to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. Nothing. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. Uh. Yeah, I'm gonna keep this to ourselves. I'm sorry, Professor, but I'm afraid that's all there is to it. Hmm. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. Gotta stick to our stories. Speak of the devil? Professor Fig, your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Everybody's pretty Perfectly suspicious, good but... good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Yes. Well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. Okay. Do I talk to Fig or what? Oh, I guess, yeah. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival? Darn right you did. I did my best, but... I'm fairly certain she suspects that we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guides map? Unfold it and have a look. Okay, the field guide map shows the classes I have to go to. Oh, that represents main quests. Okay, some have level requirements, spell and or level requirements. Okay, new spells can be earned by completing professor's assignments or as quest, re quest rewards, okay. Attend Defense Against the Dark Arts class and re rewards is Levioso. Track a quest. This is uh, Defense Against the Dark Arts. Charms class, Axio. Okay. I, I don't know which one I need to go to first. I'll just track uh, Defense Against the Dark Arts. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. That is fantastic. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Okay, so it shows... Okay, perfect. That's exactly what I wanted. Actually shows the, uh... 
shows the direction I need to take. I, is it not this way? Oh, there it is. I was like, why is the door open? There we go. Nice. That's actually very handy because I feel like I'd get lost in this place. Very big, big building. And beautiful. What, what the heck? Revelio. Has to be something nearby, right? I heard a ding. Oh, up there. Let's get to class first. We'll focus on that first. Begin Defense Against the Dark Arts class. Is that all you've got? Nebioso! Professor Hecate! Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the Great Poacher Raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in Eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. To the wise, age matters very little. Today, we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso? A levitation charm? Levioso! A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, Let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Okay, it's another one of these. Just guided along the way. This is just to unlock the spell. I actually kind of like it. It's not bad. Levioso. Now, let's try something a little larger. Can I try the skull? Oh, it's all on me again? Let us begin with a basic cast. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, a surprised opponent is a weak opponent, as Master Pruitt so artfully helped me demonstrate earlier. So break through yellow shields with control spells like the levitation spell, Levioso. So, RT... Levioso. Good. Well done. Nice. So it's just a combo. It's not bad. Very good, but the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelists, take your marks. That, uh, Time Sebastian Sallow, nice. Welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel using only Levioso, Basic Cast, and Protego. You may begin. Okay, I'm gonna try not to lose this on the first try. Levioso. This should be easy. Protego. Oh, I failed that I know. one. I know. Nothing lucky about it. This can't be your first duel. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. Levioso. I do not jump in my duel. Use the basic cost when your opponent's guard is down. So I can knock him off the board too? Is that count or is it? Huh. Not bad for a beginner. Oh, so I don't have to take down you his health. I can as knock good him as off. You get. <laughs> You're not bad for a Slytherin. That's, that's mean. They're not all bad. 
I put you on the spot and you rose to the challenge. Points to Hufflepuff. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. I will do my A best. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Can I keep Again, dueling people? Well done today. Or is that just a one-time thing for now? I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. So should I go meet this uh, Sallow dude? Right. That's is. enough spectacle for one day. Cla nice work. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? It felt more like I was dueling an expert. Sebastian Sallow, by the way, didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. I did already again, fight some statues. Perhaps this wasn't your first duel. I'm not gonna be mean. Just start boasting. I've had my fair. I've met, I've had my share of wand combat. I've dueled enough. Consider yourself lucky. Oh, that's I held not back. what I meant to go for. Huh. Fair enough. You owe me an honest duel when you aren't. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. I'm in. No need to say anything more. I'm in. Exclusive and unsanctioned. Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Okay. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club, or sneaking into the restricted section of the library. Once again, I'm you in. You just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. So it's another, uh, another quest line. Nice. Till next time. Who are you? Attend your first class. Are you just random people I can talk to? Oh, nice. All of the Revelio. Is there anything in this All class? What is this? Ooh. <laughs> nope, don't think I can get in there. I think that's it. They made a good design for this place. It's actually pretty sick. Go to charms class. What is with this if chest? If you know the right spells, it's dark wizards that'll fear you, not the other way around. What is this chest that's popping up below me? Is it is it below me or what? Revelio. Is this it? Can I not access it yet? I'm just going to assume I can't access it yet. That's a very handy feature. It's like the Skyrim, uh, what is it? Clairvoyance or something like that? The Skyrim spell? It just lights a path. And by the way, let me open up the map. I want to see where this uh, clock tower... Where is the side quest at? Yeah, where is this on the map? Ooh, way back here. Uh, I won't do it right this second, but I will do it. So it's back here in the south wing. Let's go to charms class first. Let's finish that. God, this place is massive. Revelio. Is this charms? There we go. Begin this one. 
So this is the class. The reward is Axio, I believe. Here, behind you. There is an open seat here. Not Sayo and I. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <coughs> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of charms. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right, now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the Color change and growth charms. Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you? even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm. Hmm? Hmm. Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get it to place now. Okay. I get to learn this spell. So I guess there's one of the... Yeah, I was about to say, I guess there's one of these every new spell you learn. And it might get harder and harder with the uh, more rare spells. Akio. Akio. Really? That's how you pronounce it? That is not bad. Accio. I you can't believe are a that. swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me. I thought he was about to let us go already. I was like, that's a quick class. No, we get to go outside. That's even better. Track undiscovered flu flames to unlock permanent fast travel locations. <sighs> I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> so... What better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> so why don't we have our newest students start us off? Hmm? What am I supposed to do? Just summon it closer? Very simply, cast Accio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm at the last possible moment. Okay, so now, you get more points uh, the closer you get. Think of this like get. gobstones, if you will. But instead of throwing the marbles out, you are summoning them toward you. The trick is to pull the sphere as far as possible, but not a bit more, or it'll fall. Yes? Okay, now, that's... I could keep talking about theory all day, but Stop practice talking, then. is the best, Professor. Show us how it's done. Okay. RTX. Akio. That's it! Happens to the best of us. Okay, so it, it keeps rolling then. Very good! Not to worry. Wait, what? Splendid! Still went too far. I, I lost all composure. of it. Very good. Points to Hufflepuff. I love but us. there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Okay, yeah, well, give me another Miss try. Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. 
You'll be the blues just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yep. Yes, sir. Is somebody going first or what? What's this? Or does it matter which? Okay, I'm about to lose here. Holy crap. Can I lock on? Akio. Do not think I will start going easy on you now. Ooh, I'm gonna lose this. Very badly, I can already tell. That's it! It's on me 30? I thought that was a 40. I didn't even read it. Yep, okay. I think <laughs> I think I'm gonna lose it. There we go. Oh no, this is not good. Can I just summon this a little closer? Ooh, that might be too far. Oh, just barely. Oh, that was good. Can you knock yourself off, please? Yeah. That is how it's done. I don't think I'm winning this. Can I knock her off though? If I just go like right here. Akio. Ooh, I might be able to. Oh my god, did I actually just Well played. Did I pull out the Oh my I think I just pulled that out the bag. I didn't know you could do that. I just tried it. Okay, I'm very glad. Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? Gonna make hurdles this time or what? It's actually kind of fun. <laughs> oh, I, I shouldn't have said it. <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. I'll say. Can you Day go first? Enough, chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. What's I'm just gonna try to knock you off every time. If I can. We're gonna go for that one and just blitz it. Akio. Ooh, I just gave her points. That's not good. Well, it, it kind of works. Can she blow it just once? There we go. How far does that go? I'm just giving her points. It's not changing. I think it's going to be a tie. Just blow it, please. Can I try to knock her off? That is how it's done. I think I might try this. Knock her out. Ooh, I might I might blow this though. Ooh, that's wait, did I still win that? Okay, thank god. I really want to win. Very good, both of you. Well done. More points to Hufflepuff? It's only like my first day and I'm already getting more points. Do you actually get anything from winning the house cup? Because I don't think you do. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. I like both the new classmates I've met at this point. Not Sai and that. Sebastian. I must admit, I think I underestimated you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. Thank you, but I've been holding my own. I appreciate your confidence. I, I, all of these are coming out very condescending. Wagadu just before my fourth year, my mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. Oh, so your mother's divination teacher. Nice. All of these answers I'm going for, they're coming out so condescending, and I'm not trying to go for that. I'm trying to be, like, wholesome. Be a good dude. I'm a Hufflepuff. I can't be so mean. What the heck? Is Wagadu much bigger than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. Is it really? 
So yes. I mean, everybody knows Hogwarts, Hogwarts, but... But it never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. What does it look like? Is Wagadu a castle like Hogwarts? Its address is Mountains of the Moon. It is not so much a castle as a beautiful edifice carved out of the mountainside. Can we go there instead? I remember the first time I saw it. The mist was so thick, I could hardly make out anything at all. And then it just materialized before me. This enormous school that seemed to be floating in midair. Can we just, like, go there instead of Hogwarts? I like the castle vibe, but, like, a beautiful place carved into the mountainside? That's That sounds awesome. This may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. Wagadu. That's incredible. Let's not be condescending this time. You can cast spells without a wand. Oh, yes. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. Not to mention quite convenient if one is without their wand. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic. Thank you for telling me about Yugadao. It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu. Wagadu, but I, I'm glad I to already be here mispronounced it. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Until next time. See, I already like the charms, Professor. Of Everybody course, loves a teacher that's actually passionate about what teacher. they do. It seems like that's this so dude. Inclined. You wanted to speak with me, Professor? I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You See, did I, I well, like this dude. managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Now, I ass Okay, they keep on mentioning Quidditch. So I assume there's either a game of just Quidditch, like there's a different game by these makers of just Quidditch, or we'll see it later on. Because I wouldn't be surprised if they don't mention Quidditch this game because there is their own game of just that. Hello there. You're the new student, aren't you? Yes. Hello. You wanted to speak to me. Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. Hope your first day is going well. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. That's kind of you to say. I've been fortunate. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I can't count on beginner's luck to impress Professor Ronan. Okay, so I, I feel like there is a Quidditch game, and I'm definitely going to have to check that out. I'd love to see if it's any good. Who is this, a uh, flu flame? Where do I have to go here? I have to go meet uh, Professor Weasley, I believe. Yeah, Weasley after class. Is there a flu flame nearby? That's actually not that far away. So I, I will definitely check that out. Or let me know the down below. I would love to find that out. No, it wasn't. <gasps> oh, what fun. The heck I is this? Say my goodbyes. I should cheer for the boy who says you're telling lies. I'm not telling lies, peeves. It was Albert. Oh wait, there's no, it wasn't. It was Basil things Black. on the side. Oh, Why does it feel like a Skyrim puzzle? Revelio. Was the minister of boo or the minister of flack? Okay. Stop it, peeves! You'll get us in trouble. In trouble, you. But I'll have to check it out. So let me know down below if there is actually a Quidditch game by these makers. Maybe I'll do a little research between parts. I'm I'm definitely interested on this channel to uh play a bunch of different games. Like I want I want to hit all the mainstream games. These there's a lot of games I want to check out. I'm definitely gonna check out games like Re Star Wars Rebels. I don't know how many parts I'll film of it, but Star Wars Rebels. 
I want to play the Warhammer Space Marine 2. Dead Rising Remastered. Uh, what else? AC Shadows. I, I want to check all these out, but there's also just some some random games I've found on Steam that I, I it would be so Rebellion. fun to check out. So, let me know. Is this Peeves? What is? I love Peeves. Dude, that's sick. There's so, there's so many games to check out on... I, I mostly play on PC and Steam, but I, I, I definitely want to get into filming on uh, Xbox. Maybe PlayStation 2. That's the Transfiguration Courtyard. There's just so, much, so many things that I want to check out. Just a random... I just get to pet a random cat? Like, I, I like that. It's not an Animagus, right? But there's so much things to check out. Make sure to, uh, if there's any games you want to want me to s play, be sure to let me know. I love all the feedback I can get. What was about a house the room, elf? Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. That's the first ha house elf oh, I mean. Excuse, Deke. <laughs> ah, there you are. So we had no I trust speed. your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. No, I'm just I'd that good. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? I mean, hasn't Professor Fig said anything? Have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training? He continues to be reticent about the details, mentioning only a few spells. Revelio, was it? And Lumos? That's correct, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streela. Yeah, Fig doesn't Regardless, say anything. I'm not saying anything. You must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Yes, yes, I'm down for Professor that, though. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. I mean, I'd love to ask the questions, but I'm ready to go. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. Ooh, uh, I don't know. That's a good question. I'm going to meet Salo for the dueling club, so let's go uh, Natsai Onai. Natty. I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Onai is one of our most talented students. And she knows the area. She'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Who? Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. So, side notes. I do remember, uh, mostly because of subtitles being enabled... But there was a dude named Rookwood in that memory, was there not? So, Professor Ronan, to receive your first assignment. So that's how you get certain spells. Revelio. God, they got the vibes of these classroom. Like, I love it. There's another flu. I should go meet how was Why would Professor you... Ronan. Ah, there you are. 
You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful Ooh, one repero. at that. Repero, this is the exactly what I charm, wanted. Repero. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting Ropero in no time. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. What is it? Collect a flying page near the broken statue. Collect a flying page in the Defense Against the Dark Arts Tower. Where's the broken statue? Oh, that's an owl up there. I got caught off guard by the white spots up there. This is the right area. I wonder where the flying page is. So am I supposed to use Axio? Accio, God. I feel so wrong saying Accio. Revelio. Accio. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Stop. Okay, stop locking onto that. Ooh, there it is. Revelio. How do I get it? Oh, Accio. There we go. That makes sense. So we got one more. Defense against the Dark Arts Tower. I still don't know what that is. That one is. A flying page must be around here somewhere. Revelio. Oh, right there. Accio. Brilliant. There, that's not hard. Ooh, what is this? I see all these blue things when I use Revelio that I, I just want to check out. I trust the preliminary tasks. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. I mean, Let just us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember, your wand is a conduit of your magic. Okay. Oh, we're actually going to different keys now. A and X. I started not, I started it before I even realized. I almost hit A again. Repero, nice. Men broken objects and pieces of the environment. That's it. Very good. Can I fix that if broken statue? If you'd like statue? to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. Repair it allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. Oh, okay, I already did. This is the first assignment, so that just gave me the, uh... Revelio. Gave me Repero. So I believe the next thing is to just go meet Natty, right? Got another challenge completes. 3% of quests, really? Oh, you get another legend. Oh, a cape. Nice. Oh, nice. So this is just complete four. This is not all of them. Nice. So I got some gloves. I'll definitely go equip those. This is Field Guide Pages in Hogwarts. Let's go check out gear real quick. I can get some gloves for some reason. I don't know why I need them, but I want them. Equip. Black leather gloves. Can I change the appearance of those as well? Oh, I can. Okay. It's kind of cool. The Charms Professor gloves, I like those. 
or uh, the Charms Professor gear. Because I like Ronin probably the best so far. Everybody loves a passionate teacher. So I believe the next thing is to go meet Natty to head to Hogsmeade. But I think this is where we're going to call it for this part. That's, that's not far away, but we'll do that in the next part. I hope you guys enjoyed this part. Make sure to like, subscribe, leave any feedback down below. Make sure to recommend any games you want me to check out on the side. Because I, I try to get uh, multiple videos a day. I haven't... I think Thursday and Friday this last week because... Uh, Having problems with Ubisoft and getting my account working for some reason. I don't know what's happening there, but I'll get it figured out. Because there's two Ubisoft games I want to play this year. But, like I said, this is what we're going to call it for this part. And I will see you guys next time. Take care.